whatever. All right. <laughs> so I just uh, got myself out of Odd Rock Caves. Um, last week we went through there, and I mentioned that it was a special uh, dungeon because it only takes one time unit to go through it. Um, that's all well and good. I also said I was gonna grind some in there, but I haven't actually had time to do that yet. So maybe next this next week. Um, but basically. We now need to go visit the other dungeon, which is going to be the Gorya Cult HQ. This was the other dungeon that appeared when we uh, did our meditation in this chapter. Getting my thingamajig. Yeah. So, I guess let's, uh, Gorhla? It looks like Gorhia, but I guess it's Gorhla. Doesn't matter. They're all gonna die anyway, right? <laughs> this is another really good track. But there's another problem. Basically, the place is already deserted. Or rather, completely uh, annihilated. Which is handy, I guess. I mean, in theory, we can just go through and just take all the treasure, I guess. Just a bunch of dead bodies all over the place. Treasure in here. Well, we can't really do much about it yet. I don't know. I mean, should I? Okay, here's what we're gonna do. To avoid having to spend time searching through this area twice. I'm just going to do what I already know that I need to do. So I kind of went the wrong way. And you can easily go the wrong way in here and just like completely loot the, the dungeon before you actually get to the uh, actual thing that happens. So I say let's, uh, let's go find the thing that's supposed to happen. So my net connection is all goofy again. I don't seem to actually be losing connection, I just seem to have low bandwidth, so... You may see a few jumps here and there. According to the statistics, I've dropped 0.9% of frames, so... It's not too bad, but it's not great either. Okay, so here we go. Howdy. So we've got an elder vampire. Or a noble vampire. Immediate boss fight. 
To my side, my noble I'm Harriard. <laughs> And some really strong zombies, too. That's not so bad. Ooh. Come on. Why is it missing? <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's some pretty good damage. There we go. Maybe it can't work over faint? Okay, so that's not bad. These guys aren't kidding around. Die. Nice. One down. So we took out the ambush, but unfortunately the noble vampire has gotten away. gone. That's good. So now we've got enemies populating the area. Ha! To my side, my noble I'm Harriard. Hey, this doesn't look yeah. good. Ha! Ha -ha. Yeah. Ooh, that doesn't do much. Now die. So these guys are going to throw spells out a lot. Now die. So far, so good. Yeah! Ha! Ha! 
So now there's a safe point here. Not that we really need to do much item divining. Can't use the silver roots. Fine. Oh, and may as well save. So our goal this episode will be to finish this area out, explore it completely, take out all the enemies, and finish off the boss. We've already explored a good chunk of the dungeon. Just by pure accident. Ha! Yeah! Let's try these guys on. To my side, my noble Ein Herjard. Huh. There's certainly no lack of decent folks. For my honor, finishing strike. Guilty break. Yeah, that'll do it. In war, only one can survive. Oh, no counter that time. Pathetic. There? Yeah. 
Now die! <laughs> yeah! Wow, that was close. Or, well, I guess technically, I guess I did the wrong thing, right? Would have been better if I had just uh, let Valkyrie dodge, which she probably would have. Now die! Hey, that works. For my honor. Finishing strike. Yeah, guilty break is pretty broken. Guilty break. Yeah. Dead, I see. Ooh, a guard crush. And a poison. <laughs> cure condition, cure condition, cure condition. Now die! That works. Have served me well, my Iron Hair Yard. I think he's gonna lose hit points if we. He's at four, four, six, three. He's at full health. in the area. To my side, my noble Ein Herjar. I'll take you all on. Firestorm! Almost. Not even close. How does that miss? I don't get it. <laughs> One down. Yeah. That crossbow of his must be really something, if it can shoot automatically like that. There we go. Now die. And he's down. Not bad, I guess. Of course, it was all thanks to me. the enemy awareness. Whoa! Ha! That guy's right there. To my side, my noble Ein Herjard. Hey, this doesn't look good. Yeah! Ha! 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 Yeah! That's good enough. Now die! And he fainted, which takes his turn out. And he's done. My skills will be dulled by opponents like this. And that's the other reason that uh, that Odd Rock Caves is probably a better place to level up, is because the enemies there are actually a little harder. There's some of those dragons that you can fight. They're worth decent experience. But everything here is pretty uh to my side, normal my level. noble I'm Hey, this doesn't look good. Firestorm! <laughs> One down. Yeah. 
Now die! It's interesting that you can cancel the second hit of that casual second attack there. If you, if you just jam the button. Ugh. There we go. Yeah, with good cure condition and good, uh... Yeah! Yeah. That's not so useful. Oh, he's silenced. Now die! And I think that does that. Silenced! Yeah. Gotta admit, Janus is pretty Get cool. Thee hence. Oblivion awaits thee. And it freezes. One down. That cracks him out of freeze, but that's alright. Nice. Ooh, lightning bolt is dangerous. One down. Now die! Got him. A little after the bell. He's down. You all fought so bravely. Yume has a lot of lines. Should that be any louder? I found guts. Yeah, yeah. To my side, my noble Einherjar. Father, mother, watch over me. Man, that's so great. But it does freeze one. Now die. One down. And Doctor, you can take that one out. in here. Yeah! To my side, my noble Einherjar. All right, let's give this a go. I see the end. Very effective. One zombie down. <laughs> yeah. ha. Ah. Now die. Yeah. Ha. First aid him a bit, yeah. Icicle 
very powerful. Oh, it takes them both out. Nice. Way to go, Yume. My skills will be dulled by opponents like this. is actually a really useful strategy in this game. Because faint works on most enemies. There we go. He's done. Now die! He's done. in this area. Just carefully move forward. Ha! Yeah! To my side, my noble I'm Harriard. Father, mother, watch over me. Firestorm! Ha! Ah! Now die! I'll take care of this. Finishing strike! Flashing blade! Nice. <laughs> Isn't this fun? Yeah! Ha! 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 The irony about the noble vampire putting these things out in front of us is that we're actually getting stronger, <laughs> not more tired. Not by any definition of the term. So it is now time to finish this dungeon off. I guess this will be a little bit of a short episode. Oh well. Recheck these areas. I mean, there's just nothing in here. It's just empty. How about here? Ah. Well, there's an enemy to take on, so we'll do that. To my side, my noble I'm Harriard. Hey. This doesn't look good. Castle's a little bit of a pessimist. Now die. Man, that was crazy. He like started guarding in the middle of that turn. That's just re irritating. You misjudged me. That's gonna be powerful. Now die. And he's done. I'm trying not to overuse the special attacks just to kind of we save no you guys time. To remain here. When they're necessary, I'll use them, but when they're unnecessary, I'll well, we'll just skip them. Even though some of them are really cool. 
And I'll try to show off every character's special at least once. Now, I've not been here yet with the enemies up here, I think. Or have I? Uh... I don't know. I guess I have. Yeah, this is the way back to the beginning. You gotta forgive me, this gets a little maze-like sometimes, all the back and forth. Okay, we got enemies in here. Approach carefully. And kill them. To my side, my noble Einherjahn. Alright, let's give this a go. Firestorm. That's the spirit of Cashel. Now die. That's what you get for trying to counterattack. Pathetic. You get countered. That was a little weird. But we fainted him again, so... Hey, all's well that ends well, right? You have served me well, my Iron Hair Yard. rough stuff. That's irritating. You really gotta get the timing right or it just uh totally opens you up to more guard. Phew! That didn't go quite as well as I thought. I don't know what he's complaining about. And that's the enemy in this area. And we've got a save point. So we'll just give everybody a quick little boost. Boost everybody's skills up. That's pretty good. Let's see. Find Trap and Survival, which he's already got maxed out. Max out Fight. Max out Avoid. Or I guess not max out. We'll increase it. And we'll give 
give him some more hit power. Oh, nice. Okay, Valkyrie. Set that up. interesting. Look at Genis. He's level 12, and I just topped him off level-wise, and he requires the same experience to get to the next level as Cashel and Yume both do, and they're a level lower, basically. That's very strange. But so be it. Let's see. We have any dark saviors, so let's make two of those. Uh, there's that. Three and three. We already know a void. I guess we'll learn guts. save the game, too. We're probably coming up on the boss pretty soon. that we're getting a lot of Falchions, and they're actually pretty decent. Like, they're not bad weapons. They break, but if I have ten of them, you know? To my side, my noble I'm Herion. Let's go! I'll take you all on! Now die! Yeah. It's 
not bad. by opponents like this. Alright, that clears that enemy out. And now... Bells can only make one sound by definition. If you want to make multiple sounds with bells, you need multiple bells. Say that as a physicist. I don't. I don't think we need a rest. I really don't. Like we're gonna ruin him. <laughs> Come to me, Dark Warriors. Battle awaits us. Okay, so this is interesting. Wait, this doesn't look good. Yeah. These things are bad. They're weak against dark, which we don't have anything that does dark damage. But these things are dangerous. You'll see. Yeah, they throw lightning bolts. Troublesome they explode a single special attack. Yeah, they explode and their HP is low. Frozen. And now we need to combo this one. Oh, this is bad. That's gonna explode. Yeah. It's a lot of damage. Now, we're not actually in that bad of shape. We can actually throw out a heal. And there are enemies later on in the game that do a lot more damage when they explode. Almost. Real close. And yeah, he's gonna explode. But we already know that's not too bad. The person it's worst for, I think, is what? J uh, Janus, because he has the smallest number of hit points. Yume has a really good magic defense, so she's not in too much trouble. I hope so. Finishing strike. Flashing blade. Not enough. Hey, is this for real? It shall be engraved upon your soul. Divine assault. But that is. And now the noble vampire is all alone. No hope of survival! <laughs> I'm not scared of this guy anymore. He's toast. For my honor. Finishing strike. Guilty break. Yeah. And Valkyrie gets a shot in too. Very well. I will strike again. It shall be engraved upon your soul. 
I don't think it'll quite be enough, but it's gonna be close. Eh. He's a boss, so he has a lot of hit points, but not much else. Way easier than those dragons we were fighting in Odd Rock Surely Caves. You realize resistance is worthless. Oh, he blocked it. <laughs> oh, he is done for. For my honor. Finishing strike. Guilty break. I like it. We'll have you made till the finishing blow, because why not? The gates of hell await I hope that wasn't too strong. Go back to the hole you crawled in from. Nice. You have served me well, my Iron Harrier. No sweat, right? Bunch of lightning bolts and a citrine. Whatever. And some artifacts. I don't even know what we would do with that. You can have it, Odin. <laughs> Gargoyle statue. Incense burner of Darlis. A bunch of event experience. So, there's still more treasure in that room. We just haven't gotten to it yet. Ha! And I guess... So, yeah, this this game was ported to PSP as Valgrid Profile Lenneth, I believe? Oh. I haven't played the PSP, PSP version. So we gotta figure out... trick to getting the treasure in here. Yeah! I have to think about this. It doesn't look like there's any other secret way up there, other than... Is there something up here?
There's a trick to this. I remember there being a trick to it. The trick is that you have to get the bell to fall down, but I don't remember how to do it. I don't know, I've explored the whole area. Yeah, that might... Okay, so I've got a suggestion to place the chests on top of the ice, and I think that might actually be it. You can also... You can also break the ice and... Produce, like, steps. you can only have a limit to the number of things that you can I'm real close All you have to do is get through the chain. That's enough. Ouch. And does that do it? No, there's still something else. Ether Scepter? Is that it? That's finally it? We got it. Yeah. So, it's a game of stack everything, 
Then find out that that chain is something you can climb on. Then find all the treasure chests that are hidden behind the secret, uh, behind the foreground. It's kind of ridiculous, honestly. But that will do it for today. We'll find the save point over here. And we will call it a night. Huh, that's an irritating little puzzle there. Alright, so that was the Gorhla Cult HQ. Um, next time we'll finish up Chapter 3 and start Chapter 4. I'll try to do the uh, level building over in Odd Rock Caves over the next week, and uh, I'll see you again for more Valkyrie Profile on Monday, or Descent on Wednesday, or Brandish on Friday. Thanks for watching. See you all later.